welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let us learn how to quickly identify Behance Schedule Activities User-Defined Indicator in Primavera P6. Now, let us see in detail how we can perform this. Let me consider a sample project which is having a baseline. And after updating the schedule, we can show these columns to see whether an activity is behind schedule or not. We are adding two columns here. One is baseline project finish. This is activity finish date from the project baseline. And the second column is variance baseline project finish. This is the duration between the baseline project finish date and the current finish date, which is nothing but equal to baseline project finish minus finish date. Now let us go and create the indicator. Let us go to the menu bar and click on enterprise and choose user defined fields. Click add button to create a new user defined field. I am entering the title as on schedule indicator and select the data type from the drop down as indicator. Now close this dialog box. Now again go to the menu bar and click on tools and select global change. Now click new. You can name this global change as on schedule and select under if select it as where parameter variance baseline project finish date under is is greater than or equals and value put it as zero days and into the next box in the then parameter select on schedule indicator is equal to green that is whenever the variance baseline project finish date is greater than zero it will show green else on the third box select it as on schedule indicator equals red okay friends now click ok now click on the change button then it will be showing the preview of all the changes then click on this commit changes button now click ok and close now let us show this indicator column into our columns right click on columns and select under the user defined select on this on schedule to bring to the right side selection of selector options and now click ok now you can quickly see what activity is behind schedule and what is on schedule see the red buttons and green traffic lights like this here in this column in the similar way you can do for the costing as well so friends in this way any user can easily and quickly view the activities which are behind the schedule and over budget so friends, if you have enjoyed this video tutorial, please do give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe to DB Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.